Have you ever wondered how Mars looked four and a half billion years ago? Picture a time when our universe was still in its infancy and Mars was just beginning its cosmic journey. The birth of this red planet was a tumultuous event, marked by intense heat and a molten state thanks to frequent collisions with other celestial bodies. This was a Mars far removed from the cool, quiet planet we know today. It was a world ablaze, its surface a swirling, chaotic dance of molten rock. But as the eons passed, the planet began to cool. The relentless heat gave way to a solidifying crust, forming the rocky foundation of the planet we recognize today. During this cooling process, Mars generated a magnetic field, a cosmic force field, protecting it from solar winds. This magnetic field was the final touch in the transformation from a fiery, molten world to a solid, rocky planet. So, in its early days, Mars was a fiery, molten world, slowly cooling and solidifying to form a rocky red planet. From a searing, molten mass, Mars transformed into a world with vast oceans. Let's journey back in time to the period between 4.1 and 3.7 billion years ago. Mars, during this era, was a place of warmth and moisture, a stark contrast to its current icy demeanor. Imagine the Martian landscape, not red and barren, but teeming with flowing rivers that carved their paths through the terrain, and lakes that shimmered under a different sun. The possibility of a vast northern ocean adds to the intrigue of this bygone era. These water bodies weren't mere transient features, but enduring elements that shaped the Martian topography. They left behind traces in the form of sedimentary rocks and river valleys, silent testimonials of a distant past. Could this wet face of Mars have harbored life? It's a tantalizing thought. With its warm, wet climate, Mars might have been a cradle for life billions of years ago. However, the warm, wet Mars didn't last forever. As we journey through the history of Mars, we find that approximately 4 billion years ago, a significant shift occurred. Mars began to lose the very thing that protected its lush, watery landscape, its magnetic field. This protective shield, once strong and resilient, began to weaken, gradually disappearing altogether. A strong magnetic field is like an invisible fortress that shields a planet from the harsh solar winds that constantly blow from the sun. Without this defense, Mars was left vulnerable. The solar winds seized this opportunity, relentlessly bombarding the Martian surface, stripping away its atmosphere. This catastrophic event led to Mars losing most of its surface water. The once water-rich red planet began a slow, relentless transition to becoming an arid, desolate world. The loss of its magnetic field spelled the end of the water-rich era for Mars, turning it into the cold, dry planet we know. E. From a fiery birth to a water-rich era, and then to a cold, dry present, Mars has had quite a journey. Today, it stands as a stark reminder of its tumultuous past. Wrapped in a thin atmosphere, its surface punctuated by towering volcanoes and deep canyons. The Martian poles cloaked in frozen ice caps whisper tales of a time when water flowed freely. Beneath this barren landscape, there may yet be secrets waiting to be uncovered. Some scientists believe life could exist in the subsurface, sheltered from the harsh surface conditions, and our curiosity only grows. The exploration of Mars is in full swing, with rovers tirelessly trudging across its surface, probing and sampling the Martian soil. And the next big leap? Manned missions. Yes, the day isn't far when humans will set foot on the red planet, opening a new chapter in our cosmic journey. As we continue to explore Mars, who knows what secrets about its past and possibly our own future this fascinating red planet holds?